hi everyone you're welcome to this channel so here we will look at this very beautiful question from circle geometry all right so we are given um a circle tus all right with two tangents all right tr and then um, sr or rt and rs okay and then the two tangents met at a point r um okay and they formed an angle x and then here there is a line from this tangent to you and from this tangent to you also forming an angle 68 here is y and then this is the center o of the circle and the question says we should find a question and okay. then it looks a little bit complex but can i let you know that this is very basic very very simple so what are you expected to do we are going to do some constructions but before that we would uh, you know apply some of the theorems of uh, circle geometry and one of it says that um, um, a tangent meets a circle at a point and any line that goes from the center of the circle to meet the meeting point of that tangent will the circle will form angle 90 degrees with the tangent so this is also 90 degrees with this tangent okay and then there's another theorem around tangent that says that if two tangents of a circle meet at a point that the length from the meeting point to the point where they formed tangent will always be equal so what that means is that your rt will be equal to your rs that is not all about tangent there's also another rule that says that if i am able to form a a, a line from this center to meet the meeting point of the two tangents this line is supposed to be a dotted line so that you will know i am the one that constructed it so let me break it in between okay so what this other rule says that this line that uh, goes from the center of a circle to the meeting point of two tangents of that circle is going to do two things one it is going to divide the cent angle at the center into two equal parts so if here is angle z then here will also be z and then it will also divide the angle formed by the two tangents that's this angle x will be divided into two so here will be equal to this place that's what that other rule says okay and uh, by implication you will see that we now have two similar triangles remember it is x we are looking for so if i'm able to get this angle then just multiply it by two that will give me my x in fact let's call that angle w so what that means is that our x is equal to two times w okay so we can keep that there and then if we come back here there is a rule that says that the angle at the center of a circle by an arc so here we have arc ts that the angle formed by that arc at the center is twice the angle formed at the circumference by the same arc so you can see this same arc formed an angle 68 degrees the implication is that the total angle at the center which is the 2z according to my construction is going to be equal to there you are going to have that our 2z is equal to 2 times 68 okay so um that means z alone will be 2 times 68 over 2 which is a uh, 136 all over 2 because of course this will be 2z and so my z alone is actually equal to 68 degrees okay and then haven't gotten my z why did i get z because i have a triangle remember that this is point o so triangle t o r is of course if you sum all the angles there you are going to get 180 so this one here now is 90 degrees then plus z which is 68 then plus w here everything there is going to give me 180 degrees 
okay so that means my w is equal to 180 minus the sum of these two which is 158 and that is going to give you 22 degrees and so i've been able to get my uh, w as 22 degrees therefore my x is 22 times 2 according to what we said here and that is 44 degrees it is very simple okay so i would like you to get the value of y for me in this diagram you can see why at this point let me see what you can get from that all right so comment your solution in the comment section and do give a thumbs up to this video subscribe to our channel if you have not done so we'll see you in our next video bye